Oh, man. That is way later than I expected to wake up. I got a much later start than I intend to do today, and I got to make it into the city to run a couple errands before we do this video shoot tonight. So I've got, I think, enough time, but you never know with the whole subway connections and whatnot how long that's going to take. I'm budgeting about half an hour to 40 minutes per section. Hopefully that works. forgot about New York that I definitely don't miss, something you don't encounter in LA, is having to walk behind people smoking cigarettes and inhale the smoke as they exhale it. Nasty. It's an absolutely gorgeous day here in New York. We're taking a family trip up to San Francisco area. It's supposed to be like in the 40s up there at night. So a bunch of you have been asking about my ligature. Did I change to that uh, Rico H ligature? I I've been messing with it, but um, no, I'm still using the Rovner, Rovner that I've always used. It's still my go-to. I'm here in New York to, to do some recording tonight. Yeah, I'm gonna use that, so. Yeah, I'm, not, I'm just fiddling a little bit. I mean, I always advocate not fiddling, but every once in a while, you gotta fiddle. Just heading to the studio now. I'm in New York to do some recording with Snarky Puppy. We did most of it last night. We were supposed to do all of it last night. I'm flying back to LA today. We're supposed to start at 11, 11.30. My flight's at three. So, we should be okay. I have a feeling it's gonna go right to the last minute. Here's a question from Mike, who's one of my online students, but this question has been popping up a lot recently. We've been working on some stuff with playing piano over standards. Hey Bob, here's an absurd hang up I have that perhaps will be pertinent to others. Is it better to play the tune on piano as written in concert pitch or to play the transposed key that I play on my horn? Meaning if it's in concert G minor and you're a tenor player, when you go to the piano, should you play it in G minor? or should you play it in A minor, since A minor is what you're, you're dealing with on the horn, right? My advice is to go with the concert key. If you're taking the time to learn a song, like especially a standard, that gets played in a particular key most often. I recommend just dealing with it in the key that it's in, the concert key on the piano. I totally understand why you might wanna play it in a different key to, to have it line up with how, whatever you're doing on alto or tenor to see that visually, and I'm not, I'm not gonna say that there's anything wrong with that. It's just that, let's say, you, you can only dedicate a half an hour twice a week to working on a song on piano. That's the time you have for it. If you play it in concert key and you work on it twice a week for 30 minutes over the course of a month, right? A month from now, if a friend of yours comes over to play alto sax and says, hey, let's play that song, you can accompany him at, even, even if it's um, in a bare bones fashion at the piano. But if you've spent that month 
playing it in your key on the piano, well, now you're stuck because you can't accompany that guy because you're playing it in a key that's not the right key for him. Now you have to transpose, and you're going to find yourself at the piano going, oh, crap, which... What is it now? If you spend a half an hour playing the piano and you're playing it in your tenor key and then you switch to tenor, like you're, there's going to be a pitch difference, right? Whereas at least if you're doing it in the correct keys on each instrument, the overall pitch that's ringing out the sound is going to be the correct sound. Angeles. So it's about 11 o'clock. Just got back from New York, or didn't just get back, got back several hours ago, but went straight from the airport to see my buddy perform at the comedy store in Hollywood. <laughs> Gonna try to get a little bit of work done before I hit the sack, which I need to do because we are leaving bright and early tomorrow for a trip up the coast, up to Northern California for a family wedding. Tomorrow also happens to be my birthday, which we will spend uh, driving. Be a lot of driving tomorrow. He's still going backwards, right, Sade? How is this gonna even? Fit. Okay, I'm gonna have to, it's gonna need to be loosened. It's all day. Keep okay. my, gonna... There's gotta be a, a knob or a switch or something. It obviously pivots to the front. Yeah. We have a long drive to San Francisco today and a rental minivan for the trip and rather than dealing with trying to do the phone for the music, I'm gonna get some CDs. One Ten Sumner's Tale, Radiohead OK Computer, Michelle and David Cello, Peace Beyond Passion, maybe a Michelle Bitter as well, Portishead Live, Kurt Rosenwinkel, Hardcore, Very Best of Sting and the Police, James Taylor, Greatest Hits, Dave Matthews Crash, Branford Marsalis, Romances for saxophone. Frippinino travels. All right, that's that's a lot actually. Gary Clark Jr. Big fan. He's awesome. You like this music? Some good stuff. And I got like just a cheddar egg and bacon sandwich. Okay. It's on wheat toast. They don't really do bagels. He did. It made me look you up. Where are those from? Just last year. We'll see it because I couldn't see them. Yeah. Whoa! This <laughs> thing would be proud. And here's the Richmond Bridge. Oh my <laughs> gosh! Watch. I don't have Well, hello. Okie dokie. Hello. Here's your shoes. Cracker. Here. Here we go. Let's run. Let's run. Okay. Huh? Got it. Look, 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 look. Watch oh. Come on. This is our room, Dada. It might be a little big for you.